Good morning everyone. Today's lesson for grade 5, chapter 10, lesson 4, multiply whole numbers and fractions. Okay. Uh, boys, before starting today's lesson, I hope you guys finished the homework for last lesson. And I already uploaded the correct answers on Pioneer and uh, Edmodo. So you guys can correct your answers before starting this lesson. And get ready with your books and pencils to start today's lesson. Uh, boys, make sure one thing that please submit your homeworks only through Pioneers. And if anyone don't have uh, access to Pioneer till now, he can submit through Edmodo till that time until he get access to Pioneer. Uh, please don't submit your homeworks through WhatsApp. Okay, let us start our today's lesson. Uh, multiply whole numbers and fractions. The first thing boys, look at this thing here. They want to tell you that you can write any whole number as a fraction with the denominator of 1, which means the same thing. Like for example, it is 12. You can write it 12 over 1. Let's take example. If you have 12 chocolates and you have to divide it uh, on a single student, so of course that lucky guy will get all, all the chocolates. So you can write any whole number as a fraction with the denominator of 1. Let's say 12 is 12 over 1, 6, 6 over 1, 14, 14 over 1, 15, it will be 15 over 1. Okay, let us move to the first question here. The first question is saying, wild parrot spend 1 over 6 of the day looking for food. How many hours a day does a parrot spend looking for food? Okay, so how many hours a day? There are 24 hours in a day. Okay, so you have to multiply 1 over 6 times 24. What they are doing here guys, 1 over 6 times the same thing which I showed you up. You can write a whole number as a fraction with the denominator of 1 uh, but let me tell you an easy thing here what they are doing here uh, 1 times 24 and 6 times 1 that is 24 over 6 what you guys can do uh, just multiply the whole number with the numerator no need to rename this whole number into a fraction just multiply this new uh, this whole number with the numerator 24 times 1 that is 24 and 6 in the denominator okay now you have to simplify this to simplify uh, the first step let me show you here down you can divide the numerator inside and the divisor denominator outside 6 times what will give you 24 6 times 4 that is 24 when you minus it's 0 so here the answer is 4 okay boys uh, the second thing if you are fast enough in division you can directly check how many what is this you can directly check that how many 6 you can take out from 4 so 6 times what will give you 24 or less than that so that is 6 times 4 okay let us move to the next page uh, let me turn on the answers so you guys can see this okay next now boys again the same thing 2 times 4 over 5 2 times 4 that is 8 8 over 5 then you have to simplify it you can use the same process again division 1 or you can do it mentally uh, let me show you both here uh, 8 as a dividend and 5 as divisor 5 times 1 that is 5 minus 3 so this one is here and the remainder here and the denominator same down the other way boys you can see directly that how many 5 you can take out how many group of 5 you can take out from 8 that is 1 
and if you take out 1 5 what is the remainder 3 over 5 got it okay let's clear the screen and move to the next question same thing here 4 times 1 that is 4 over 2 2 how many 2 you can take out from 4 2 that is 2 okay move to the next page uh, this is independent practice boys but let me solve two questions with you uh, 12 times 1 12 over 3 boys you will write it like this okay 12 over 3 that is equal to 4 this one 20 over 4 that is equal to 5 okay you can solve the remaining questions uh, by yourself and let me show you the answers so you guys can verify your answers after you finish okay let's move to the next page Alita is making nacho cheese dip for a party she need to make five batches how much salsa will she need how much salsa was this from here you have to take the data how much salsa is needed for one nacho cheese dip half cup salsa one pound cheddar cheese and one pound hamburger okay so what you guys will do you'll multiply because you need to make five batches and half cup salsa so five times half that is equal to five over two when you convert it into a mixed number because this is an improper fraction it will be this how many two you can take out from five two and the remainder one over two cups Similarly here, 1 over 4, you multiply this 1 over 4 with 20. 20 times 1, 20 over 4, and that is 5. Okay, boys, uh, let me clear the screen so you guys can see the next answers clearly. three over five hours every day and how much in each week so you have seven days each week so you multiply three over five with seven and that is four whole one over five okay boys which one is different from these in question number 17 uh, 12 over 2 that is equal to 6 18 over 3 that is equal to 6 36 over 6 that is equal to 6 this one is equal to we just solve it above five okay boys have a nice day and try to finish your classwork and uh, homework and submit your homeworks through pioneers or edmodo please don't send your homeworks through whatsapp have a nice day